could you knock on the door? Only got so many hands here. Sarah! That for me? Yeah, though it's not as much as last time. It's enough. Nona thinks you're an angel. The Dawn hates seeing food go to waste. And this? This has got to be Tammy. Sarah told us all about ya. That right. You're a famous race driver, Tom. Everyone talks about ya. Yeah, she's right. They do. Well, anyways, don't let the cold in, Juliet. I'll see you at church. All right. Have a great evening. Night. Buena noche, Tommy. Hey, Mama! Your angel Sarah brought more food. It's nice you do that. That? Well, a lot of hungry people on this block. Yeah. Well, it's, um, it's a good night for a walk, anyways. Don't get yourself killed on my account, Tom. I try to avoid it. That's all you got? You spend all this time with a lady killer like Sam Trapani, and the best line you got is, good night for a walk anyways? <laughs> well, it is, ain't it? Yeah, I guess so. Flowers for the lady, signore? Nah. We're good. Now I don't get flowers? When you let me take you on a real date and not some walk home for Luigi, then you get the flowers. Eh, that could happen. If Pop's not gonna stop me seeing one of you's, I think he knows anyway. Luigi? Nah. These guys have been creeps to me for weeks. But I didn't tell you as I know what you like. I mentioned it to Dad this one time, and all of a sudden he gets you to be my knight in shining armor. So yeah, he knows. Huh. Well, like I say, means there's no problem with me. Well, if he did, you wouldn't last long. I know what happened to all the other guys I dated. I helped hide the bodies. Ah, so now we are... I've been trying to keep you safe, Tommy Angelo. All this time. Hey, let's go someplace. Tomorrow night, maybe. The pictures, maybe. You can get your flowers. That'd be good. Oh! Hey there, darling! Are you stepping out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten, doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. What do you say? We going to have trouble here. Trouble started back when you tried to steal our girl, Chief. You saps aren't careful. You'll end up in wooden overcoats. <laughs> Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. <laughs> I don't need Salieri. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well... <laughs> then let's see what you got, Cake Eater. Mm. Sweet cheeks. Fish, ain't ya? Get away from me. Twist like he's wasting on You even touched me and you're dead. You're wasting on your dead people. I'm not the kind of dame you mess with, pal. <laughs> Tommy! My turn now. Hope you're better than you. Hey! 
That's what I got, you son of a bitch. You got a good right hook, I'll give you that. You're bleeding. Come up to my place. I'll take a look. Well, you gonna come in and take a load off, or what? I'm wondering when you'd invite me up. The bank's closed, slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? No, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can see it fucking hurts, Tom. You want to pretend it don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you get? Compliments of the Dan. Take another. All right. You're gonna grin and bear this? Yeah, I'll be okay. Good. Because I don't need the little old lady next door complaining at the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Oh, it's gonna take as long as it takes. The sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. They're right. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. Ma would really go after Luigi sometimes. He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. Right through the hand. What for? Because she was an ugly, jealous drunk. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. The scar will be something to remember you by, if nothing else. <laughs> You're staying over. Can't have you stumbling through the neighborhood pie-eyed. Not when them hoods are out looking for you anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. That's up, though. This can't stand. Sarah's okay, boss. I took care of it. She started working here before she could see over the bar. I don't have a daughter of my own, Tom. I'd do anything for Luigi's little girl. So would I. We all would. That's right, boss. Anything for Luigi and Sarah. Do those bastards think this is fucking Luna Park or something? I'll rip them apart with my own hands. Our business is protection. But who's gonna pay up when they learn we can't even protect one of our own as she walks home from work? So what do you want us to do? Teach these boys a lesson. Break every bone in their bodies. Put them in wheelchairs. Bust their faces up so bad even their mothers can't look at them without screaming. We know where they're holed up. My friend on the force says we should start looking into Chinatown. Then Big Biff will know something. Tommy. Go to Vinny, get us some gear. Meet me at Biff's place. Yeah, okay. Leave these punks laying in the street. I want everyone to know, we do not allow mad dogs to run wild in our neighborhood. 
You got it, boss. Some of these sons of bitches could still be on our turf. I'll check the neighborhood. Make sure they're gone while you see Biff. Good hunting. Yeah, same. Okay, so when you're done with Vinny, come find me in Chinatown. Sure. Let's go bust some heads. Hey, here for some heaters, Tom. Nah, I'm already going and healed. Paulie and me, we gotta give a beating to some punks who've been on our turf. I don't wanna pull this and piss in our own street. There's something to bust heads. That's all we need. Sam turned over some guy's warehouse and, uh... Autographed by Babe Ruth himself, the guy said. I mean, that's horse shit, but... They bust heads. Your punks won't have time for questions. No, they won't. Thanks, Vinny. Time. Come on, I'm wet through. Why Biff moved into this dump, I'll never know. Give him a break. He's in love. Ah, he got yellow fever the time we boosted the Shanghai skin flicks. Well, I like her anyways. The problem with you, Tom, you always soft with the dames. Bill pals with a prissy chump and a bruiser with a bald head. Right, right, I know them. They're set up in the old service station a block over. They hock some gear every now and then, in small time. <laughs> That's why I need to come to you, Biff. You're good with small time. Out the back, cross the street. You'll find them there. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Paulie. Uh, about that dough? Relax, just waiting for my guy to come through. It'll be next week. Just sit tight.
What was that back there? You and Biff got something going on. Uh -huh. Guy I know is bringing in a shipment of suits. Classy ones, Mexican. You getting suits from Mexico? No, idiot. The suits are boosted from a lockup downtown. The tailor is from Mexico. Originally, anyways, he lives in Holbrook. Did not know about this. Yeah, yeah, I'll get his cut. You just keep this under your hat. I guess I heard nothing. You gonna know these punks when you see them? Yeah. Though, I guess if I don't, all we gotta do is find the other guys in Chinatown who look like we do. There it is. Here's how we do this. I walk in and start beating people. We do the same. No shooters. You take long thinking that one up. Nah, the plane gets used a lot. I think we gotta go in through the side. Telling you the nicest ass I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yo. Oh, Billy, it's the guy from the other night. We gotta go. Come get him! Guys, you get out here! Get him! No! I'll make two of that hurts.
Johnny, get down! Oh, come on, come on. Get us out of here! Shit, we gotta get to a car, Tom! Scram! Come on, we can't lose them! Reloading! Oh, careful, Tom. The road's a river. Don't That's worry, all. I got this. Ever seen guys piss their pants this quick? If you look through the rain, you can see it dripping out the back of their car. These guys are gonna regret they ever set eyes on Sarah, huh? Drive like I have. I'm reloading. That's all. Come on, you're better than this. Dumb son of a bitch just wrecked himself. Well, they're not walking away from that. I want to pop him, Tom. No. No, no, wait. Please. Please, I don't want to fucking die, man. Christ, Tom. You can't feel sorry for these animals. A guy like this would plug you if you give him the chance. You gotta pull the trigger without thinking. Come out. This one's finished too. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> mm. Oh Christ, Tom. Snap out of it. You remember what those guys wanted to do to Sarah? Yeah, just, uh... Hey, let's get out of here before the bulls show up, huh? Simple straight. Oh. I can't afford this life no more. Just getting lucky. I'll give you a chance to win your money back. You want in, boss? We have business to discuss, Paulie. We're in it now, boys. One of our associates at the coroner's office sent this over. Corpse's name is Giolotti. You recognize him? Sure. That's one of the punks we ran out of the neighborhood. Now we got the bullet in the back of his head? Yeah. We capped him. Well, the cops ought to thank us. We did him a favor. The guy was a rapist, boss. Yeah? Well, he was also a city councilor's son. 
You want to drive a politician into Morella's arms? There's no better way than killing off his family. Oh, Christ. That gets worse. You left another guy in the wreck? Yeah, but he was dead when we got there. You gonna tell me he was the president's nephew or something? Two in the head, Pauly. If you're gonna do a job, do it right. He made it? Yes. He spent the week in St. Mary's, but he pulled through. <sighs> Can he point a finger at either of you? I don't know. Maybe. Okay. Look, we're gonna kill two birds with one blast. Galati's funeral's today at St. Michael's. Sam, you're gonna attend. Sit in the back and try to spot the lucky bastard. How will I recognize him? He'll be the one who just crawled away from a car wreck. His arm is broken. Look for a sling. Sam's gonna need a little distraction if he's gonna clean up your mess. Are you sending Tommy to dip his wick? Is it brothel? A gentleman's club, just down the street from St. Michael's. The Don has invested a lot of money in it over the years. So me and Sam. Regardless, the owner has suddenly decided to do business with Morello instead of us. You want me to go remind him of his obligations? Yes. Then blow the place up. What? Morello wants to take businesses away from us? He'll inherit craters. Look, Tom, we can't send Paulie and Sam since all the ladies know them already. They'd never make it through the front door. But you can walk right in. Okay. What about the manager? Take care of him wherever you find him. If any of the horse see it, well, it'll be a warning. Once he's out of the way, head to his office on the top floor. Grab any documents and money you find there and place the explosives. Vincenzo will see that you have what you need. And you think the blast will be big enough to give me cover? Yeah. But be smart. Only take a shot if you know you won't get made. Tommy, one more thing. One of the girls is passing Morello information about our operations. Before you blow the place, you'll need to take care of her, too. You want Tommy to kill a twist? Come on, Frank. It's just bad luck this falls to Tom. But we gotta protect the family. Her name is Michelle. She's usually working one of the upper rooms. Her photo is in the folder. You boys clear on everything? Yeah. Tom. I got it, boss. Then get it done. See Vinny. I'll meet you here. Heard you in the market for something that goes boom. Give those girls a squeeze from Uncle Vin, huh? Not today, Vinny. Don't go anyplace yet. You gotta hear me out on this. It's about the girl. Michelle? Right. You don't have to rub her out. Just make her disappear. You know her? Yeah. I've been with her a few times. She's a good egg, Tom. Just maybe not so bright. She doesn't deserve to get plugged just because she likes listening to me talk. You think she'll leave, Tom? When she understands what'll happen otherwise, yeah, she'll leave. Here's a hundred. Give it to her. And make sure she gets far away. Okay, Sam. I'll see what I can do. It's all I'm asking. Let's go. Michelle. She's the one from the racetrack, right? Tom, that was the last time we were ever gonna talk about her. Ever. I told you what I had to ask, and you listened. Gotta leave it there. Okay. Keep your head when you get into the hotel. Find your mark and don't act suspicious. The manager thinks he's untouchable. He'll probably walk right up to him. Anything else they should know? Nah, just don't take all day. Lottie died young, so there can't be much to say about it. If the bomb goes off, I'll do my thing. Got it.
What kind of world is it that when you screw up, you get sent to a cat house? Well, I have to clean up your mess at a funeral. You see the justice in that? I see a job I gotta do. Such a profession. Just try to finish a job this time, huh? First time I've been to a church in a while. I'm gonna guess they're still singing the same songs. First time I went, it was. Same songs I always heard as a kid. Yeah. What's with you you're today, not Tom? The religious type. Yeah, you're not the religious type. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Wow. You tried like this in your old job. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Again, point, there were so many funerals, I just stopped going to most of them. They're all boring as hell. That's a shame. Seeing as you're always dressed for the occasion. Great gag, Tom. Write that one down. Thanks. I'll do that. Now, weddings. Weddings are less boring. I'd go to one of them. You working on that? Uh, I guess so. Good. Because I've given up waiting on Polly. I couldn't get a broad to stick to him if they went swimming through glue. Ah, he'll find someone. Tom? His own mother has given up hope, and you can give up hope too. What's with you today, Tom? Michelle, she's the one from the racetrack, right? Tom, that was the last time we're ever going to talk about her. Ever. I told you what I had to ask, and you listened. Gotta leave it there. Okay. Keep your head when you get in at a hotel. Find your mark and don't act suspicious. The manager thinks he's untouchable. You can probably walk right up to him. Anything else I should know? Nah. Just don't take all day. Glad he died young, so there can't be much to say about him. When the bomb goes off, I'll do my thing. Got it. What kind of world is it that when you screw up, you get sent to a cat house? Well, I have to clean up your mess at a funeral. You see the justice in that? I see a job I gotta do. Such a professional. Just try to finish a job this time, huh? First time I've been to a church in a while. I'm gonna guess they're still singing the same songs. Last time I went, it was. Same songs I always heard as a kid. Yeah, you're not the religious type. It's the funerals, Tom. That's all it ever is. All that anyone ever wants to do is point guns at the family and shoot. Game point, there were so many funerals, I just stopped going to most of them. They're all boring as hell. Well, that's a shame, seeing as you're always dressed for the occasion. Great gag, Tom. Write that one down. Thanks. I'll do that. Now, weddings. Ah. Weddings are less boring. I'd go to one of them. You working on that? I uh, guess so. Wow, you drive like this in your old job.
Uh, guess so. Good. Cause I've given up waiting on Polly. Guy couldn't get a broad to stick to him if they went swimming through glue. Ah, he'll find someone. Tom, no, I'll not. give the family your condolences. Good luck. You too. Sono pazzi? Hey, you behave hey, yourself in here, okay? You here for a girl, drinks, or a mix of the two? A girl. And I got some business with your manager, too. A girl? I can help you with. Come through. Find a girl you like. You can both get better acquainted upstairs. There's no rush, so get a drink, relax, and hey, good enjoy afternoon, yourself. Sir. Come through when you're ready. I need to talk to the manager. Yeah, head straight through to the lounge. You're with our uh, new business partners, I assume.
this your first time with a heater? Gonna reload. in my sights. Ugh. I see him! Cover. Get him! Out of the picture! Moving to cover! Together! Gotcha! Uh. Gonna hang you out to dry. <sighs> Taking cover. You, Michelle? What's it to you? A fella named Sam is one of your regulars. Maybe there's a lot of guys named Sam. You know him. Works for Don Celieri. Maybe you got him talking about our business from time to time, and maybe Don Morello offered you some money to spill what you heard. No, Sam, trust me. I, I don't say nothing. He knows that. But Don's losing a lot of money because someone <laughs> can't keep their mouth shut. I was just bumping guns with some of Morello's girls. I didn't mean nothing by it. So I'm sorry. So I will never open my mouth again. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're scared then. Good. Don't you ever forget how it feels to be this scared. To know you're just one twitch away from a hole in the ground. 
Because if you ever show your face in this town again, they're going to find you with two in the head. Do you understand? Lucky for you, Sam's got a big heart. Get dressed and make tracks. This place is going to blow soon. Thank you. Just don't come back and we're square. Use that thing? Got you now! Moving the cover! Come and get me then! More web that came from! Shit!
No matter how far we've fallen, we can find redemption in death. Now, William, he was a sinner, yes, but he was also a loving son, a protective brother, and a loyal friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now, I believe, one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. I, uh... I just wanted to pay my respects. Billy, I never said this, but... I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good... What are you do Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy! Big news today. Read all about it. Please! Jesus, what was Billy involved over in? Over here! Over here. Over here. Over here. This getting some trouble! Shit! Oh, you got some trouble now, tough guy! Down there! Shoot him before he comes up the stairs! Shit! Oh. You know what? You could have stopped all this days ago. This is the way this city works. 